everybody, welcome back to Tears of Themis. My name is Jess, and I'm an official Tears of Themis content creator. In this video, I'm going to be talking about achievement tasks. Just to preface, I will say that you have to unlock these achievements. And how you unlock those is you have to complete Episode 1, Act 17, in order to get access to the achievements along with your daily and weekly tasks. So how you're going to access your achievements is you're going to go to your tasks. You have your daily, weekly, you're going to click on this tab. Here you're going to find individual character um, achievements as well as story achievements here. You could earn maybe more than 2,000 uh, S-chips, um, Stellan, uh, card evolution materials, things like that. I'm not sure if you could, let's see, if you could get fragments. What is this? Okay, I don't know what that is. But as you can see here, for example, I'm working on Luke's achievements right now. So I still have to clear episode one of his story. Then I'm two cards away from getting this achievement. Collect 20 loot cards. You know, you get the gist. You collect cards, you upgrade. You'll earn 50 S chips just for collecting that character's cards. But they have to be 20 different cards. So please keep that in mind. And or in upgrades for upgrading cards, you get 50 S chips. And then you'll get... um this common upgrade material here. And that will be um, especially for uh, Luke. And for SR cards. So there are many achievements you could go through. Um, I'm not sure um, during uh, like the beginning of the game if, if you could um, achieve most of these. But as time goes on, as you keep playing the game, you're going to be able to get a lot of stuff. Here I have like a ton to do. Like <laughs> I got to do Artem's personal story. I got to collect cards. You know, there's a lot to do if you want to hit those achievements. Um, just be aware. It's a lot of grinding, but it's so worth it because you'll be able to collect... Um, uh, like materials and S chips, you know, in case you want to uh, uh, pull on the next vision banner. Um, Stellan is very important as well because you're going to need lots of Stellan as time goes on to upgrade your character cards as well as level them up. But I mean, it's pretty self explanatory. Yeah, you, you guys are going to get a lot of rewards once you complete all these. Um, oh, and story achievements as well. Yeah, here are story achievements. Um, I haven't did a lot of these, it looks like. <laughs> but here in the beginning, once you start these, see when you... There's an achievement when you reach level 10 and you'll get a hundred S chips. For level 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. You enhance one card to level 40. So these should be pretty easy to get, I would think. Um But that's pretty much it. Um those are your achievements for Tears of Themis. If you have any questions, please comment below. I'll be happy to answer them or any other questions about the game. And that's it. I hope you guys have a lovely day and thank you so much for watching. See you soon. Bye bye.